Hey everybody, all right, so every now and then I like to go through my things and clear out the products that aren't working for me, that I don't use, that are just kind of taking up space. I really don't like hanging on to things and this just doesn't have to just do with makeup, it's everything in my life. I like to throw out things, it sounds weird, but I just like, I just like things that I use frequently in front of me and things that I don't to go away. I don't find the need to hold on to things. So that being said, I recently went through all my makeup stuff out how many products I am getting rid of. I'm not going to throw them all out. I'll see if people in my my life want them if they're good and I would recommend them, but some things I definitely will be throwing out. Um, I'm going to preface this by saying I used to purchase a lot more makeup products than I do now. That's why there's a lot of things. A lot of these things I've been hanging on to for years. It's not something I've purchased recently. Yes, I went through a makeup like buying... I don't know what you'd call it, phase uh, a couple years ago and tried out a lot of things and I haven't been buying that that much here recently. I just buy the things I know work now so I don't find the need to hold on to these things but I thought I'd share with you guys before I threw them out. I'm going to run through it really quick because this video is going to be forever. This is the Airspun, Cody Airspun Loose Face Powder. Heard about this from Tati's channel. Um, I don't like the smell of it. It smells very perfumey and I just feel like there's a lot of chemicals in it and I don't know. I don't like it. I don't like loose powders to begin with. This is the e.l.f. Beauty Book Bright Eye Edition. I did get a lot of use out of this. Um, those are the colors. I just don't use it anymore. I have a lot of these colors in other palettes and it's just taking up space. I never use it. So I'm getting rid of it. This is the Hard Candy CC Cream SPF 15. It's, it's a decent CC cream. It does okay if you want really light coverage, but I have so many other ones that are like way better that I'm, I'm just never going to use it. So, saying goodbye to that. Another palette is the Dark Shadows NYX palette. Years and years ago got this. I just don't use it. Came with some blushes and lip products. Way too shimmery. There's the eyeshadows. They're not very good quality, so I never use them. So I'm saying goodbye. Trying to get the big things out of the way first. That camera battery is gonna die too. This is a palette I got at iMats a couple years ago. It's a concealer palette. That's what it looks like. Looks wonderful, right? So excited about it. Not good. Not good quality concealer. It's heavy and separates and creases and it's not good. Not good at all. This guy I've had forever. This is the NYC Smooth Skin Bronzing Powder used to use this all the time. I went through a few of these. It just, it's a little bit too orange for my skin tone, I've decided, and therefore I don't reach for it anymore, so it's, it's gonna sit there. So I might as well get rid of it, because I don't use it. This is the e.l.f. Daily Moisture Stick. I thought this would be a good idea for like under eyes, extra moisture, but I never use it. And the few times I have remembered to put it on before my makeup, or even after my makeup, it says you can do both. It just made my concealer under my eyes a little wonky, so. We'll not be using that. This is the Milani Brow Fix Brow Kit. I used to use this all the time. That was my color, the middle one there. I liked it, but I don't use brow powder anymore. I have another product that I like better, so no sense holding on to it. This is the Mary Kay Translucent Setting Powder. This is actually really nice. I didn't buy this, it was sent to me. Um, it's very nice. I just, like I said, I don't like loose powder. I love my um, NARS Crystal Light Reflecting Setting Powder, so I don't think I'll be using anything else. So there's no point in hanging on to it. I don't know how many times I'm going to say that. I'm going to stop saying that. All these things, there's no point in hanging on to. This is the Cella Eyeliner Pencil Pen thing in blue. I don't use blue liner, liner very often, and I think it's pretty much dried out. This I've had for so many years. Blushing Rose NYX blush, a bit too dark for me. Really pretty, but I just don't reach for it because it's too dark for me. Another good powder is the Tarte Smooth Operator sample. Really liked it for under eye setting. I did use quite a bit of it, but I like my NARS better, so yes. This came in an Ipsy a long time ago. This is mascara and glitter. I'm never going to wear glitter mascara. I can't think of a reason why I would, so. And this is the Body Shop Brow and Lash Gel. Got it for brow gel, really hate it. Um, just makes things crunchy and no good. All right, a bunch of lip butters. I used to be, oh, it's telling me to change my battery. Hang on. 
Alright, so these are the Revlon lip butters. I used to be really into these. Pink lemonade, creme brulee, creamsicle. I just, I don't use them. Um, I don't find them hydrating and I don't really like the colors or the color payoff. I like other things more. I don't know, you kind of grow and your tastes change with makeup. This is the Hard Candy Blush in Living Doll. I like the, the lighter version of this highlighter better. This one doesn't really work as a highlighter and is way too shimmery for a blush, so no, no. Throwing out a bunch of random eyelashes. <laughs> Red cherry eyelashes and Revlon eyelashes. Just eyelashes that I've already worn that I don't need to keep around. Oh, or individual eyelashes that I never use. Um, this is the Pop Beauty Quad, or Trio. Even Ipsy. I don't like cool tone silver smoky colors on my eyes, so I will not use that. This is the e.l.f. High Definition Under, Under Eye Setting Powder. It works really good. I would recommend it. But I like my NARS better, so yes. This dried out. It's the Scandalize. You can see it there. It's broken off. That needs to go. This dried out also. It's a purple eyeliner pen from e.l.f worked really good though. This is an e.l.f. jumbo eyeshadow stick. Pretty color, but it creases. This is the NYX Butter Lip Balm. I just don't use it. Again, it came in Ipsy. This is the Rimmel Wake Me Up Concealer. I did use it for a while, but I found things that work better. It's really old anyways. Same with this True Match Concealer. This one creases. This is the NYX eyeshadow base. It's quite dark. I did use it for a while. It's quite dark. Um, and honestly, I don't use eyeshadow primer anymore or eyeshadow base. My eyes don't need it. This is the Revlon Colorstay Whipped Cream Foundation in Sand Beige. This used to be my Holy Grail, Holy Grail foundation. Why? I have no idea. I don't know how I ever handled this on my face. It is so thick and heavy. It's funny how your your um, preferences for makeup evolve because there's no way I can put that on my skin now. I can't handle it. Again, no offense to any of you guys if you like these things I'm getting rid of. This is the e.l.f. Makeup Mist and Set. I don't find it does anything as far as the setting spray goes, so there's no point in using it. NYX Rio Trio. I don't like the quality of those. A whole bunch of MAC eyeshadow sample pigments. I want some kind of contest. I was sent those years ago. They're probably expired. Pixi Beauty Primer. It's too, um, what's the word? Glowy for me. Too glowy. Glossy Box um, Blush. I don't like the color. Model Co. Mascara. That sucks. Really bad. This is a Tint and Sass Lip and Cheek, cheek Stain. I'm not into stains, because once you put the stain on your cheek, if you don't blend that out really well and really fast, you're kind of screwed. More Revlon Lip Butters. Some of these Revlon Lip Stick things. I don't know, I used to be into them. I'm just, just not anymore. More of them. You guys must think I'm crazy. But like, I don't like hanging on to things and I'm not going to use a lipstick from NYX that's a color I don't wear, a Mary Kay color that I won't wear, an Apocalypse, which is just too hard to wear because if you touch it, your it moves on your face and then your face is stained. A lip gloss that I got at the dollar store, but I don't like the color anymore. Random Kabuki brush, brush that's really quite pokey. This I think is actually empty more than anything. It's the Gimme Brow. Love this. Don't really want to repurchase it because I like the Anastasia brow pomade and I don't need it, but it, that's very nice. Essence Quad. Again, don't like the colors. Too Cool Tone. This is empty. It's the NARS Laguna Bronzer. It's going. This I've had forever. It's Brown Sugar from Urban Decay and it's like a bronzy highlighter stuck my finger in. I kept thinking of reasons that I would use this, but I don't. I don't reach for a bronzy highlight. I like a champagne highlight. 
This is cottage cheese jumbo eyeshadow pencil from NYX. It's just old and dried out. A shimmer eyeliner in this color, emerald green. I'm not gonna use that. A color whisper that I don't like. The I'm Tired from Hard Candy, it depuffs. This is actually quite nice. I used it for a while, but it's just another step in the process of doing my makeup that I don't need. Fabuliner from Jordana, it dried out. It's okay, but I really like the Stila one like 10 times more. Bare Minerals Pure Radiance highlighter. I don't like loose pigment highlights. The Random Lipstick, that's from Glossy Box. Lash Grip Adhesive Eyelash Glue that I don't like. Pacifica Eyeshadow Duo, I don't like those colors. I don't like this color eyeshadow. I don't like this color eyeshadow. It's basically white. A lot of these came in Ipsy. I don't like the quality of that. I don't like the color of this uh, lip liner. Almost at the end, um, a little Lorac lip gloss that I won't use. And the last product is from Benefit, and it's the Stay Out Straight Eye Primer. And again, I don't, I don't need eye primer. Hopefully that video wasn't too long. So those are things I'm giving away or getting rid of or throwing out or whatever. I just don't need them in my life anymore. And I hope you guys enjoy it. Thanks for watching. Bye.